My annual home office tour was such a hit, I thought, why not do a What's On My Desk weekly tour? Usually I wouldn't show you this stuff, but, you know, it may be worth doing. Let me know if you like it. If you like it, like it, comment. Let me know if you want to see me do more of it, because I've got to move this stuff off the desk, because i got more stuff coming in. First, let me say that I've got Maker Deck up on this screen. Tons of 3D printers going 24-7 on Twitch. And over here, live.perillo.com is happening on Twitch as well, the Chris Perillo Twitch channel. We moved the live stream over there, and it's working wonderfully. If you love playing video games, you love geeking out, talking tech, software, hardware, screen sharing, uh, having fun, just knowing that it's there for you, for us, it's happening. Live.perillo.com redirects there. I want to start here in what's on my desk because someone sent me these two items together in a package. Uh, the second series of the uh, the Micro Galaxy Squadron a, a, a blind box. And these I, I, I really want because these all have little figures in them, certainly. I, I'm a big fan of the figures, no matter the scale. But I, I was just, I was shocked that Either someone knew I wanted this, or I added it to my Amazon wish list. I'm not exactly sure who sent it, but I'm very grateful. I'll probably be opening this blind box at some point on the live stream. Oops, I knocked into the Aki. Yes, the Aki from Snorks. I've been 3D printing a few Snorks lately, uh, models by Hex3D. This is a uh, Flexi Snork, Flexi Aki. I've also got pieces of uh, some uh, other Star Wars figures in uh, monochromatic uh, color here, this silk color from Polymaker. By the way, same... Same filament there, Polymaker. Um, these are, are going to be like Ember's Royal Guard, Clone Trooper, a Dark Trooper, and then I believe that's a Snow Trooper in these various colors. I've got to move this item out of the room because I had two of them, these Hot Wheels. They don't really make many of these anymore, at least this particular type of uh, Hot Wheels vehicle. Um, but I, I'm happy that I already had one, and I'm, I'm going to move that one. Here is a case for the phone I'm using right now, the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra. This is a case to five case. They send it to me. It's personalized. Look at that. I'm going to be working for Dunder Mifflin, paper company. Uh, Dwight Schrute is my manager. I will be assistant to the regional manager in sales. Uh, pretty happy about that. Uh, hopefully, Dwight is a, a nice guy. If you know anything about him, uh, let me know. Pick this up on sale. The uh, itty, bit, itty Bitty Bitty Boomer. <laughs> I put Itty Bitty in the title, but it's a Bitty Boomer. The Santa Grogu. Half off. Couldn't pass it up. Uh, this was on Amazon. If you want to uh, keep up to date on all the latest tech deals that we find, we post them to the Discord in conjunction with the, the live.perillo.com feed. Links are in the video description. No reason that if you're going to spend money, you shouldn't save it. In fact, Glendon has been finding a ton of hardware tech deals. If you're big into PC building, we'll be building another PC on live.perillo.com soon. Uh, got the Ray Valentine Pop, a part of the series this year that would make that particular series complete uh the latest marvel issue uh for darth vader 31 the reason i still get the the marvel issues though i don't really have a comic book store anymore is because they allow you to redeem each particular issue as a digital copy so you can have it in your digital library and i appreciate having that i was going to show you the page upon which never mind it's in there you get the redeem code in there somewhere oh look it's my keyboard you've probably seen that before you haven't seen uh, my espresso because i sipped it there's a decaf espresso i got to get more of that soon uh battleship cartridge yes back when games had cartridges nintendo ds i uh, got this complete with instructions thrifting the other day i'm not sure if i can open it just to show you right there when I find uh, retro games for a decent price, I'll pick them up. Because you never know, I might want to play Battleship on the Nintendo DS. And you, you know, also never know, I might sip a Peepsy. Pepsi and Peeps, even though I, I don't drink soda, and you know how I feel about Peeps. I hate them. Plus, I'm, I'm vegan now, so I can't eat marshmallows. Uh, but 100-calorie can, couldn't pass it up. Got a 10 or 8-pack, had to put my initial on top, otherwise Diana would drink it. These were actually pretty good. Uh, not really a soda drinker. But uh, it tasted a lot like cotton candy, at least the first few sips, especially very, very cold. So, yeah, I would say this is a winner, not being a soda drinker at all. Picked this up thrifting as well, a Darth Vader 01 Blue. And I guess there's another variant uh, in terms of color, but this was produced in 2010, part of the first waves of uh, Star Wars Funko Pop Vinyl. So found that and very happy. Got the box for the uh, Samurai Taisho Darth Vader. Now I have the two variants. Uh, and have them on display in, in the uh, home office. You'll have to wait for another full home office tour to see it, possibly. Picked up a, a few uh, reaction figures on sale, if only to army build the uh, Cobra Troopers, H-back and Y-back there. Love these series. And I wasn't sure if I already had the MC-12. Uh, it may have been something I skipped, if only because it was a paint variant. But I love 
uh, what they do. If I collect G.I. Joe and Transformers toys, by and large, they are from Super 7 because I'm a fan of 5 POA. I mean, I grew up with these figures back in the day, but 5 POA is all I've ever wanted from those figures. 3D printed this Yoda. It's got a nice sheen to it. A good Charlie sheen, slightly Martin sheen. No, it's actually a silver sheen, also printed with Polymaker filament. Uh, it's hollow with lightning infill. Uh, two walls, and it worked really well. It's modeled after the uh, vintage uh, Kenner toy, and I printed another one in a silk green that I like a little more than this one. It'll be a make a nice gift for somebody. I've uh, been preparing to get these boxes off the desk. Of course, you know I bought the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra. This is the thing I'm using to record 8K video right now. There's the SVU wallet case, which I absolutely did not like. Glad I got it for free as a part of this purchase. And another super fast wireless charger, Duo, which is fine because, you know, we already had one uh, a year ago. Uh, when when I ordered the other one, for the most part, if you remember, if you remember, sorry, I got a, I, I'm doing something, I'm I'm managing things on on the screen as I'm doing this. I've got OBS pulled up because I'm looking at the other snork that I'm currently 3D printing on the bamboo. Anyway, so not going to be opening that, but I'll hold on to it indefinitely, just in case we need it at some point in the future. The Egghead Darth Vader, Glow in the Dark Egghead Darth Vader figure. I got that. Also 50% off recently. That was a nice find. Uh, there are the remaining pieces for the uh, figures that I have to put together that I showed you here at the, the beginning of all this. Also picked up some Lego sets on sale, including the Infinity Saga set that comes with Korg. Very happy to finally have a Korg minifigure. Ended up getting two of these, one to open and one to keep in the package. I love the plastic on the front because you can actually keep that tray to use for something else. It's uh, styled like a minifigure. Also got these two sets on sale, specifically for the minifigures, uh, the city set, and the Black Panther. It's nice. Very, very nice. Just dropped a figure there. Now, I would normally just keep it to what's on this desk, but I'm going to pop over here very briefly because I actually have some spillover here, uh, including uh, some Black Series figures from this wave that I have to get through and open, as well as the latest Vintage Collection wave that includes the Artillery Stormtrooper that I'm very happy about. Also have these mini figures to put away and some uh, supports that uh, were repurposed. In, in the actual model to be used as like a little Star Wars trinkets. Also, as an update for those who remember the Home Office Tour, I ended up going back and getting a Grand Moff Tracta. Oh, that, that has to be opened as well, the Luke Skywalker Snowspeeder Prototype Edition. That's just this week. That's what I got to get through this week. Like, so, and there's there, that box, that box is going to be full of the stuff that I got to move out of here. Uh, so, thank you again for watching. Thank you for listening. Uh, you know, if you want to see me do this again, because I will get stuff... Every week, it will pile up, and I'm very happy to share with you what's on my desk. But just in case you're, you're interested in the other thing, keep in mind, 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, I'm interacting with you, allowing you to play alongside me, typically talking tech, at live.perillo.com. We'll see you later.